Sabrina Fulton was among 50 prominent black women celebrated at the Women of a New Tribe exhibit. Also recognized as a highly esteemed woman who I have the honor of working with right here. My co-host Trina Robinson, their gorgeous portraits were unveiled at the Stephen P. Clark Center in Miami. Oh, it was such an honor. And to be with those women of that caliber who've done so much to craft and shape mm. our community, um, I just feel humbled and proud. And you deserve it. Thank you so much, Joanne. But the photographer not only capturing their beauty, but also the great contributions these ladies have made to the black community. The Women of a New Tribe exhibit encapsulates the awesome power of 50 black women making their mark across South Florida with fab faces, profound poses, and dramatic finishes. Cox Radio's Jill Tracy loved how the creator captured the essence of her. But I felt like he just really got just my joie de vivre. And yeah, I'm really happy. I can't wait till we can take him home. Face to the light. The light is our friend. The he she mentioned is famed photographer Jerry Talafiero. Before the photographic portraits were hung at Miami Dade's Stephen P. Clark Center. <laughs> I got exclusive behind the scene access as Miami Dade Commissioner Barbara Jordan and others work the camera for an exhibition he's taken in the past around the country and the world. In a, in a sentence, uh, I want them to understand that beauty, the beauty that strikes the eye is very fleeting. That uh, you have to see what you're sold. Sabrina Fulton, the mother of slain teen Trayvon Martin, was one of the honorees. Smile, both smile. The Thank photographer you. even took the opportunity to include her mom. Sabrina, what was it like seeing your finished photograph? I don't know. It just was so, to me, the pictures that I've seen so far are just so powerful. And um, I know this is the year of the woman. It's always been a woman's year. The Miami Day Black Affairs Advisory Board this year is calling it right now the year of the black woman. The event, the brainchild of Miami-Dade's Black Advisory Board, and the unveiling ceremony celebrated all of black history. As those who came to admire the photos joined in an old-fashioned gospel sing-along. Then, the audience was awed by spoken word artist Rebecca Butterfly Vaughns. I give thanks for the women who fed nations of children from their breasts children that didn't even come from their own womb. I just yeah. think about my daughter and get all over so much. Public relations titan Suzanne McDowell of Circle of One Marketing brought style and confidence to her photo shoot. You know, to look and see, you know, in the eyes of all of these women and, you know, feel them, that's the most important thing for me is I want somebody to look at my picture and feel my personality. And so, you know, people are all so different, and, but we're having in common that we're black women. I was also honored to be a part of the exhibit. So, Jerry, I am in place. Here's a look at my photo shoot as I got dolled up for lots of flashes of the camera, multiple outfits, and now the final work of art in black and white. He did a phenomenal job. It was great working with Jerry. The collection of South Florida photo portraits will ultimately become part of a book that catalogs the photographer's work and these women for all of eternity.